We're not used to this as DC fans. I'm sorry. We're used to quality, at least in the costume department, right? Even DC's worst films had good costumes. Like, for real. You can go all the way back to that trash film, The Flash. They still had some good costumes in that movie, man. Even Green Lantern. Good costumes in that movie. Hell, even in Wonder Woman 1984. Good costumes in that movie. Even Catwoman. The one with Halle Berry. That still looked like Catwoman. However, when it comes to these two characters, they do not look like their kind of book counterparts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This looks like a reboot. <laughs> you know, when they try to reboot something and, and it doesn't have the same quality as the universe that they're trying to reboot, that's what's going on here. The more that I see from James Gunn's Superman, the more that I understand that we're going to be getting something that is absolutely trash. First, we got that Superman reveal, you know, with that bag-ass suit. And then we got the Mr. Terrific reveal with those wide-ass sideburns. And now we have Plastic Girl and Homer Simpson Green Lantern. I swear, you can't make this stuff up. James Gunn believes that he is cooking with this film. However, someone needs to tell him just because he's putting something in the microwave isn't the same as standing over a stove. Now let's get into these photos, ladies and gentlemen. As you know, we already went over Superman. He's standing there to the right. Now let's get to Hawk Girl first. Hawk Girl is a huge downgrade from that of the CW TV show and also Hawkman in Black Adam. This looks absolutely ridiculous. Why is everyone wearing leather jackets in this universe? I know many people are saying, hey, they're with this program, you know, controlled by Maxwell Lloyd. They are the Terrifics, right? I don't care anything about that. What I am talking about here today is design, right? Think about that for a second. Everyone has on a leather jacket. Why? This doesn't feel like a superhero film, ladies and gentlemen. Now let's get to Green Lantern here. He looks like a bottle opener. He's too damn wide to be Green Lantern. Nathan Fillion is not nailing the look. I, I am sorry. He's too damn old, too wide in the ab area. And look how skinny his legs is. Come on, these people are not looking like superheroes, ladies and gentlemen. Be real with yourself. Let's look at some more photos here. I think we're going to have to go to X to see the rest of them. All right, let's check this photo here out. All right, in this photo, we have Mr. Terrific and Hawk Girl taking flight while Green Lantern or Homer Simpson is standing there with Superman. I don't know if they realize that Hawk Girl is supposed to have wings and her being that close to Mr. Terrific, she's going to slap the hell out of him. Like for real. Hopefully they fix that spacing in post, right? What else we have here? There he is right there. I'm talking about Green Lantern. Looks like all he does is drink a 12-pack of beer every day, ladies and gentlemen. He's not in shape. I'm sorry. I am not trying to body shame anyone here, right? But this is a superhero film. And I hate to say this because it, it may sound a little sus, but Green Lantern isn't sexy, man. I'm sorry, he's not. He's not. He's not at all. Superman saving a kid here. And we have Green Lantern and Heart Girl walking in front of him. And Mr. Terrific with this exoskeleton suit on. I thought he's supposed to have spears, but I don't know. Maybe James Gunn couldn't figure that out correctly. You know what I'm saying? Let's go back over here. What else we got here? I know we got some more photos here. Right here. Right here. Somebody come look at this. Please. Please. Look at this. Hawk Girl looks like she's a teenager or a sidekick trying to be a hero. And Guy Gardner here looks like he's on a break of retirement. The jacket isn't working. The shoulder pad isn't working. The whole suit just isn't working. 
What is James Gunn thinking about with this, man? I am sorry. He's dropping the ball hard here. Do we have more pictures? We have more pictures. Okay, we already seen that picture. But look at the look at the stomach. Look at that. It is ridiculous that he went with this design. So let's look. Let's go here. Let's do something here. Now look at that 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 Green Lantern, right? Look at that Green Lantern. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. That's a Green Lantern. Right there. That's 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 what a Green Lantern suit's supposed to look like. Let me go back so I get a better picture. That's what a Green Lantern suit's supposed to look like. Right there. That's what a Green Lantern suit's supposed to look like. Say I'm lying. Say I am lying. Let me let me show you another Green Lantern suit that that looks pretty good. Show you something else. Look at that. This was filmed in a backyard without a studio. This was filmed in a backyard without a studio. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? Now, let's go back to God. Come on, you guys. Come on, you guys. Come on, you guys. Really? Really? This is what you're willing to praise here? And let's look at Hawk Girl. She, she she ain't she ain't free. Look at this. Hawk girl CW. Look at this. That's a hundred times better than what James Gunn is giving us right now. Wait, let me get a better picture here. Why does it keep doing that to me? Right here. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Even though they're still going with the leather design. It still looks better. It looks like it's from her home world, doesn't it? And you look at this. Look at that. That looks like it's from Earth. Yeah, people are saying that they're a part of this group. I don't care. I don't care. You're taking away the essential design of the character to try to make sense to your story. I do not like that. And you know what? Let's go to another Hawkman slash Hawk Girl design. Let's go to Black Adam. I just hides, man. Look, look at this. Look at this. Check that out, man. Look at that. Hawk Girl is got to be one of the biggest downgrades in movie history, right? I mean, when you look at I just Haas design, right? Look at that. It looks cinematic. Oh, I didn't want to go to YouTube. Why am, why am I on YouTube? <laughs> I'm uploading this video to YouTube. All right, there. That's the one. That's the one, baby. Look at that. Look at that. Look at it. It looks so cinematic. What is this? What is this? I know people are saying that they look like they are cosplay players, right? No, 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 no. I think that you guys are not giving those who love to go to Comic-Con and all of those geek conventions, you know, I don't think that you guys are giving them enough credit, right? This looks like Party City costumes. That's what this looks like. In fact, this looks like something that you can find in the, in the aisle at Walmart around the October the 31st. That's that's what this looks like. I'm sorry. James Gunn needs to do better. It's almost as if this guy is trying to put this Guardians of the Galaxy feel to these suits on this, and it's not working. It's not working. We're not used to this as DC fans. I'm sorry. We're used to quality, at least in the costume department, right? Even DC's worst films had good costumes. Like, for real. You can go all the way back to that trash film, The Flash. They still have some good costumes in that movie, man. Even Green Lantern. Good costumes in that movie. Hell, even in Wonder Woman 1984. Good costumes in that movie. Even Catwoman. 
The one with Halle Berry, that still looked like Catwoman. However, when it comes to these two characters, they do not look like their kind of book counterparts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This looks like a reboot. <laughs> you know, when they try to reboot something and, and it doesn't have the same quality as the universe that they're trying to reboot, that's what's going on here. Just like the Tomorrowverse, you know, the animated universe, it doesn't look as good as the previous universe. Everyone knows that. And we're dealing with the same situation here. That's how I feel. I'm your boy O. Hopefully you have watched this video all the way to the end to help you boy out that algorithm. And if you're not subscribed, please be sure to do so. I'm trying to reach that magical number of 3,000 subscribers. I'm currently 101 subscribers away from that threshold. So I will be highly appreciative. You will help your boy out cross over that threshold by hitting that subscribe button. And if you are going to hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that notification bell because YouTube absolutely sucks at notifying subscribers that content creators has uploaded videos to their platform. And don't forget to hit that like button. To help out that algorithm, baby, but in the comments below, let me know what you think about this trash that James Gunn continues to issue out. And also, do you believe that they're going to fix all of this up in post-production with VFX effects? And if you ask me if you need to do that for your costumes, then they were never good in the first place. Let me know in the comments below. That is one big pile of shit.